All right, I just saw 1942's The Mummy's Tomb. This movie is 60 minutes and 34 seconds long. And the first 12 minutes are a recap of the last movie. This is the October 15th movie in the Monster Movie Every Day for October 2022. And I watched it on Blu-ray. Okay, I was actually really excited when I saw that it's the same cast as this one. Um, the Steve guy and the, the Babe guy. I was, I thought it was, I saw the same cast, so I was like, yes, we're continuing, because I really like that guy. He thought he was, that he was a good, good leading man. Also, this is the first time that Lon Chaney plays the mummy. So he's played, uh, Frank, he's played the Wolfman, Frankenstein, and now he's playing the mummy. So this is, this is kind of cool to see his range of monsterisms. Also, look at this cool font. My friend pointed out how cool of a font it is. All right. So my excitement for the same cast returning very quickly disappeared when I realized that they got Steve being an old guy here. And I don't know where Marta is. I don't know if it implied that he married her or what, but she's not here. It, Babe eventually does show up, but it's mostly a newer cast. Also, let me reemphasize, this movie is one hour long, and 12 minutes of it are a recap of the last movie. Also, uh two of the villains from the last movie are here and it's like it's basically like we re we returned somehow it's like palpatine returned all right this is my favorite shot in the whole movie when they're rolling into the cemetery look at that yeah i just think it looks so good once again this movie has some awesome shadow effects with the mummy uh, the plot's really simple. Let me pause this when I get attacked here. Uh, the plot is very simple. It is the mummy is back in, or he's in America and he's going to wreak havoc on all those who woke him up in the last movie. And uh, the, he's pretty effective with his body count in this one. I'm not going to lie. I was pretty much yelling at the TV on this part. I was like, no, Steve. Okay, this is also one of my favorite shots here. Just these... The new mummy's new master and him just hanging out, getting ready to do some bad stuff. Of course, I always like to see the carrying pose from the posters in these things. See that? I mean, that's impressive. He's dragging his foot while carrying this lady. Anyway, I really like to see the, the monster carry pose in these, so I like to highlight that. Also, look at how good, look how good he looks. Look at that. That was a nasty, scary, lumpy, multi-layered mummy right there. Long Cheney's doing a good job. Alright, this part gets pretty rapey with what this guy's intentions are. And then, of course, you got a mob with torches. So, I was like, this isn't this isn't Frankenstein. Why, why are we all torch mobbing? What's going on here? We got guns and stuff. Once again, I take serious issue with some of the, the gun usage of the professionals in these shows. This guy's shooting at the mummy who's right here, and there's people right behind him. So it's just like, man, I know you're trying to get the mummy and you want to get the kill, but it's like, pay attention to your dadgum backstop. You're going to hit something you don't want to hit. So anyway, I enjoy these movies, and I know that it, they're not serious and real, but it does it does get in my brain a little bit when they when they shoot <laughs> like this. All right, so honestly, it's hard to have an opinion about such a ridiculously short movie. Uh, it was nice how short it was. It was a fun little adventure. Uh, it was not very good. Um, this is definitely on the lower entries overall out of all the monster movies. Um, you should watch it if you want to see all the mummy movies or if you're looking for a cheesy Halloween movie that's very short. But yeah, it's not very good. Um, com compared to even the mummy's hand right before it was better even though that was kind of a reboot of the first mummy um but this one had a good yarn and then of course the ending is pretty on par with these kind of endings uh the blu-ray looked and sounded okay nothing nothing either way to report good or bad uh the next movie so this has been the october 15th movie the next movie is 
Frankenstein meets Wolfman, and that is October 16th, 2022. So thank you for watching. Let me know if you're watching these and if you've seen this and if you like this one and what you think of the fact that a massive portion of it is just a recap of the last movie. All right. Okay. Thanks. Bye.